stuff. Kitty play stuff. Hey, I'm Katie, and this is Katie Plays Stuff, where I play stuff for you. So today we're gonna be playing some random games. We're gonna be playing, I think, three, maybe four, I don't know, just little games that are free that I downloaded online, and it'll just be a nice, fun little video of random crap. All right, let's get started. Okay, first game is called Save the Date. <laughs> so I just randomly downloaded these games online. They're all just short, stupid, short, sweet, and stupid. Um, and in this one, we are gonna be saving our date. Let's get going. Oh, okay. Ring, ring. Hello? Oh, you're early. You must be calling about tonight. I meant to ask where we were meeting. I know we were planning on having dinner, but we never decided where. Where are we having dinner? Ooh, Felicia wants to have dinner. Okay, okay. Um, do burgers sound good? Ooh, I gotta turn this down. Okay, two burgers sound good. How about Thai food? I think tonight needs to be taco night. Actually, I don't want to meet up tonight after all. Um, obviously taco night. Hooray for taco night! Felicia is basic. I can already tell. Hooray for taco night. This was a good idea. Everything is better with tacos. I've heard good things about this place, and I hear they got a new chef recently too. And I really like how they're out on the docks like this. It's like we're eating right on the water. Where do you want to sit? Out on the patio outside, of course. How about near the window where we can see the water? Let's see if they have a free booth. As much as I would normally get a free booth, because uh, I like booths, let's go out by the water, because I feel like that will impress our date. Uh, the two of you sit down at a table near a giant window where you can look out over the water. The sun is starting to set and the waves are turning gold colored. The effect is quite beautiful. Okay, let's have some tacos. Do you have any recommendations? I hear their fish tacos are amazing, but I'm open to other options. Fish tacos, you're right, they're to die for. An enchilada plate. Actually, I really like the chicken. I think I'll have a fiesta salad. It's got mango in it. Um, never in my life would I ever eat fish tacos. So, uh, an enchilada plate. Hmm, tempting. But not tempting enough. Fish tacos for me, please. <laughs> Felicia, you would, you would. Can I have a check, please? <laughs> I hope I don't sound obsessed to you, but for some reason, I'm just really excited about tacos tonight. I'm not normally this obsessive, honest. Doubt it. Do you ever get like that, obsess over some particular thing you want to the exclusion of everything else? Who asks something like that? Uh, not really, I'm pretty easygoing. Yeah, sometimes I can be pretty single-minded. Um, I'm pretty easygoing. Haha, <laughs> I guess. Oh, what's that? She points out the window. Are those dolphins? I think those are dolphins. You follow her as she runs out to the railing to look over the ocean. It is dolphins! Oh, I'm so glad we came here tonight. This is so awesome. Have you ever seen anything quite like it? Um, no, this is incredible. Once, maybe, this sort of thing doesn't happen often. A lot, actually. Every time I've been here. Actually, this is important. Take two steps to your left right now. Um, no, this is incredible? She gazes out at the picturesque scene for a moment longer, and then several things happen all at once. Whoa, what's happening? Too quickly for you to react, and yet somehow, with agonizing slowness, the railing and, in fact, the whole patio collapses into the sea. Felicia tries to jump for safety as soon as she feels everything begin to move, but she's not quick enough. You lose sight of her in the churning water amidst all of the debris from the deck. That was the last time you saw her. The currents near there are known to be treacherous, and they never did manage to find a body. What? Okay, so our next game is called Forgotten. I forgot to read what this game was about. I just got really good reviews. So, all right, let's see. Welcome to Forgotten. Uh, if you want to pick something up, right click on it with the mouse. Okay. Is there something over here? What's this? Picked up a bracelet and put it on your wrist for safekeeping. This is yours. It represents every memory you've ever had. Hold on to it. 
For what is a person without memories? Every single individual is the product of their past. Okay. Uh, pressing E will tell you more about what you're looking at. Not looking at anything, so... Alright. Um, Middle-clicking toggles your lighter and allows shift. Holds you to sprint. Oh, I got a lighter. Whoa, those graphics, though. Alright. I was wondering what that was. Uh, because the game itself is so incomplete, you should expect a lot of placeholder graphics. And bugs. Consider yourself warned. Okay. If you're interested in aiding in the development, now open the door and follow the light. Oh, 3D artist? Yeah, I'm not talented. I can't do that, so let's keep going. Uh, open the door, follow the light. Seriously, if you get lost, look around until you see the things light up. Okay. Um, oh, oh, okay. Hold on. Um... That scared me. Okay. Alright. Where do I go? The lighter does nothing! Let's just run. Is there a monster here? What's the point of this? Keep walking until you see things light up. I don't see nothing. Oop, oop. What is this? Water? I don't know what this is. Nothing? This light. I don't know what I'm doing. I found a house. I am so good. All right. Let us go inside. It's very bright in here. This is nuts. Can't pick up a candle. I don't know what I'm doing. What does this say? Do not be fooled and think that a man's memories will not free themselves from his mind. Oh, whoa! It's normal now! So we're in a memory, I think. It is, uh, August 11th. It's Thursday. Ooh, and there's a baby that's due. Am I pregnant? Or was my wife pregnant? This must be the bedroom, the master bath. Did I just go- the master bath? The master bedroom! <laughs> what is that? Is there somebody in there? Oh. I thought there was like a door back there because it was so dark. Alright, um... So there's the crib. What am I pick what am I holding up? I don't know. It said you're supposed to press E to examine what you picked up, but it didn't work. Uh, Samantha's diary. You can see a lot of pages that have been torn out or illegible. Um, February 19th. I asked mommy to bring in my diary when she went to empty the buckets, so now I can write it on to pass the write in it to pass the time. Maybe now it won't be so boring here. I asked mommy when we could back out and live the rest of- I asked mommy when we could come back out and live in the rest of the house, but she keeps telling me not until the bad man goes away. Who is the bad man? Why won't he leave us alone? Today she boarded up the windows and the door. She's getting really scared and so am I. It's been forever since I've seen daddy. I swear I saw him outside the window last night, but it was so dark. I wonder if the bad man got him. I really miss him. Out of food, and mommy has to go all the way to the grocery store to buy some. She told me not to leave the room just in case, but I found the key to all the house doors under my pillow. I couldn't stop crying after seeing all the old photos of me, daddy, mommy. We were so much happier before we had Nikki. She brought home some really fancy necklace. She says it's for my sister. She talks about her like she's real, and sometimes it really worries me. What if she is real and I just can't see her? Daddy told me that mommy needs help, though. Last night, Daddy knocked on the window and said he was going to get me and take me where it's safe. I've never been happier.
So it seems to me like um, the mom kicked the dad out of the house and told the daughters that he was a bad man. Um, but really, the mom was nuts. I'm so sorry, I had to do it. Please take her to the hospital for help. Door's locked. It's under the pillow. Under that pillow? No. Right there. All right. What's in here? A sink? That's it? The heck? I don't... <laughs> Where am I now? This is getting kind of creepy. There's no baby in the crib, but you feel like it wants you, like it needs you. Okay, this is freaking me out. So let's say I'm hungry, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. What's that? Was I there before? Oh, it must be for this. Can I unlock it? No. Maybe it's for this door? heck is in here? Um, same day. It's a kitchen, but all the things are everywhere. Fridges! Oh my god! It's a bottle. Picked up the baby's formula. What do I do with it? Feed the baby? You put the formula in the crib. Okay. I'm gonna be an awesome mom someday! Now what? Leave? That was awesome. Uh, the bad man will get me. Oh. What does that say? Where's my teddy, mom? I can't sleep. I'm afraid the bad man will get me. And then there's another key. This is weird. Alright. Is there a teddy bear in here? Oh, this is creepy. There it is. Um, can I take it? It won't let me pick it up. <gasps> what the? What the? Hold on. What is that? A key? And blood? What happened to my baby? My invisible baby! I got a key. Key for this? Oh. Hold on. I can't pick this up, so I don't know. A hospital. <laughs> um. Oop. 
Well, bye. <laughs>